I watched DistroTube's video on UFetch the other day, and as a long-time user of ScreenFetch, I never really noticed how slow it actually is. Until, that is, I saw UFetch in action, and now I can't help but notice how slow my ScreenFetch actually is. You know, not to say that ScreenFetch is bad, I mean right the opposite. It doesn't matter which distro you're running, ScreenFetch just works. But I believe therein lies part of the problem. With all of its compatibility, it's inherently slow. It's finding a lot of information and formatting it and displaying it to the terminal every single time you open one. And that little bit of time there is noticeable. UFetch, on the other hand, is more distro specific. And it's super duper fast. It's minimal and it looks quite nice. But in all honesty, for me, I don't really care about the text colors for, e for in either one really. And I wish UFetch, while still being fast, displayed some more information that I wanted it to that I wanted to be displayed. And I wanted the larger Debian ASCII logo instead of the small minimal one. You know, that one's more attractive to me, but I know that's completely subjective. To sum up this little intro, I like both utilities. I like them both a lot, but I wish for features from each one to be together. So I did what any self-respecting Linux user would do. I borrowed some code and some inspiration, and I wrote my own. Let me show you. So here we are in the terminal, and I just want to show the speeds of each one first. And let's do screen fetch first. Oh, let me get clicked in. See, it's a it's kind of slow. There's a there's a very noticeable pause there before it ever displays the the information that I want. So now. Let's look at UFetch. It's right there. And that looks really, really nice to me. But I do wish there was some more... There we go. <laughs> I do wish there was some more in the list. And I wish it had the larger Debian logo. Let's look at the one that I wrote. Forgive me for the terrible name. I named it Deb Info because, well, I was tired and it was 4 a.m. And, well, yeah, there you go. So let's clear this and let's look at mine. I think that's that's still pretty quick and it has the, and it has the list that I want. If you'd like to take a look at it, let's go over to my GitHub page and I'll show you the code. So here we are at my GitHub page now github.com slash linux slash deb info and here's the code you know it's 31 lines long it's you know nothing huge by any, by any means and it's and this is debian specific but it can be easily adapted to another distro you just have to the way i laid it out you just have to change the ascii art here and a couple of things up here and you're ready to go. What I want it to display, I want it to display my user and the host name, the OS, the desktop, or the desktop environment rather, the which kernel I'm using, how long it's been up. I actually borrowed this and this and this from UFetch. I want it to list which CPU I had, and it, it's doing a lot of gripping and setting and a little bit and a little bit of awking just to get everything to list out the way I wanted it to. So it's displaying information about my CPU, my GPU, and it's listing how much free RAM I have. To be showing as much information as what it is, I think it's still pretty quick. Now I am far from a developer, so if you look at this code and you see something wrong or something that I can improve, please, by all means, let me know. I mean, either 
in the comments or in on Twitter or on MeWe or something along those lines. Any feedback is greatly appreciated. So let's look at it one more time. What do you think? Thank you for coming along for the ride on this fun little project. If you like what you saw, please consider subscribing for, for more links and tech related videos in the future. You know, as always, thanks for watching. Y'all have a nice evening. Like, share, and subscribe.